this morning we'll be looking at ever present in time of ebb psalm 46 verse 1 god is our refuge and our strength and ever present help in trouble god is an ever present help in trouble but we sometimes allow bitterness to keep him at a distance and thus we miss his help. A young Irish immigrant, Joseph Scriven, was deeply in love with a young woman and their marriage plan had been made not long before the wedding day. However, she was drawn for months. Scriven was bitter in utter despair. At last, he turned to Christ, and through his grace, he found peace and comfort. Out of this experience, he wrote the familiar hymn, which has brought consolation to maidens of aching hearts. What a friend we have in Jesus. All our sins and grief EBS. Sometimes our way lies in the sunlight. It was so for Joseph Scriven as he approached his wedding day. But like him, we may find that our path also leading through the dark shadow of loss, disappointment, and sorrow. At times, this is within our power to turn our suffering into occasion for a, f- a female grips of God and make them shine a true which is a sure and a brighter hope may flow in our souls. Business loses, pension that don't pay is to be, lose of work inflation, the sickness that lay us alone, the sorrows that robs our homes of light, children who rebel or turn into blessing for those who by then become less attached to the head and more attached to God. Trouble will not hurt us unless it does that, does what many of us do, what many of us too often allow it to do, hurting us, making us so bitter and skeptical. The trouble will be a trustfully brings to us a fresh vision of God. I come again. The trouble will be a trustfully bring to us a fresh vision of God. As a result, we discover a new outlook on life. If we make our sorrows and trouble an occasion for learning more of God's love and of His power to heal and bless, then it will teach us to have a female confidence honest providence and as a result of this the brightness of his love will fill our lives trust god with a childlike dependence and no trouble can disturb destroy you even in the last dark hour of death when your flesh and your heart fail you will be able to depend in peace upon him who is the strength of my heart and my portion forever psalm 73 36 let us pray our father and our god thank you for always being present in my life i feel your arms around me by faith i see your angels protecting me through the eyes of trust i sleep in peace because you watch over me every hour with you in my life i am never alone and with jesus in my thoughts i am never afraid in him I pray. Amen. May the Lord bless this word in our hearts. In Jesus' name. Amen. Don't forget to join me tomorrow for another exhortation like this. Till then, stay blessed.